on this video we will be doing Thevenin's theorem so what the theorem says is that if we have a complex circuit like this we can simplify it by just connecting the Thevenin's voltage in series to Thevenin's resistance and the load resistor of the original circuit so you need to go to the load resistor remove it take it and connect it in series with the Thevenin's resistance the Thevenin's voltage so that's what you do but now do we know the Thevenin's voltage no do we know the Thevenin's resistance no that's what we must calculate for us to calculate um you might you can start with whatever you can start with the Thevenin's resistance you can start with the Thevenin's voltage as long as you remember the rules the rule says for us to calculate the Thevenin's resistance we come to the circuit um remember the load resistor is removed so we have an open line here so when we're calculating the Thevenin's voltage we must come and short where we have the cells and remove the cell so we would remove this cell and and replace it with the short wire we would have an open line here so these resistors will be connected in parallel so to calculate R Thevenin's we, we just calculate the total resistance of this parallel resistors that are connected in parallel say we want to calculate R, um, I mean the Thevenin's voltage the rule says we just take the circuit that has an open line here and calculate the, the, the voltage across that resistor and that resistor and use those voltages to calculate E Thevenin or the voltage the Thevenin's voltage so now that you know the rules let's apply them and calculate R Thevenin and uh, R Thevenin and the Thevenin voltage and then we'll later calculate the current across the load resistor okay which one we'll start with to me it's easy when we start with the load with the Thevenin's resistance the rule says we short where we have where we have cells so we would remove the cells and replace them with the short this resistor which is 7 ohms comes back and we have an open line here since the load resistor is removed so we had a cell here we'll replace that with a short and that resistor which is 5 ohms comes back so the total resistance of the circuit which is the same as the Thevenin's resistance will be calculated by 7 times 5 divided by 7 plus 5 which is gonna be the calculator will tell us so 7 plus 5 the total resistance of the circuit would be 2,917 ohms so we know that we have 2,917 ohms and remember this load resistor that we removed is 2 ohms so now let's calculate um, the Thevenin's voltage Thevenin's voltage says we, remo we replace the cells so let's put back the cells um, the only trap when we calculating Thevenin's voltage is uh, the voltage polarity across these resistors across the on volt drops across these resistors that you will see that you will see just now so this is the circuit we would have and this is 13 volts this is 
180 volts um, and that is 5 ohms 7 ohms <clears throat> so this one is positive here negative here positive here negative here but what about the resistors since this cell is is bigger than that one this will make this resistor positive and negative on this side this one positive and negative on this side so now whatever volt drop that we get across these resistors how will how we calculate it will be determined by the voltage polarity so now let us calculate a volt drop across um, these resistors how we can calculate it these resistors are in series so that means we need to calculate the total current of this circuit once we know the total current of this circuit, we can then use the current to calculate the volt drop here and the volt drop here. Now let's go. What is the total resistance of the circuit? These resistors are in series. It's 7 plus 5. 7 plus 5 is 12 ohms. Now if we know the total resistance, we can calculate the total current remember when we're calculating the total current this 30 will subtract will it will be 30 minus 13 because these cells are opposing one another the total resistance is 12 so this makes the total current be 30 minus 13 all divided by 12 or 7 plus 5 is equal to 1,417 amperes. So our current here is 1,417A. This current is the same as the current that flows here and the current that flows here. In the series circuit, the current is the same. The only thing that is different is the volt drops. <clears throat> Let us calculate the volt drop across that resistor. It will be 5 times 1,417, which is equal to times 5. It's seven comma zero eight three volts. Now let's come here. Seven times one comma four one seven is equal to nine. comma nine one nine remember this is seven times one comma four one seven so that is the volt drop across that resistor so now the polarity of these volt drops is very important for example if we want to use this cell to calculate um, to calculate the Thevenin's voltage we would say 30 minus 9,919 why? because if you if you look at this um, it's positive positive it, this is like this um the cell this this is like this 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 voltage which is um it's like this minus positive then positive then you see so now 
this is what makes us subtract because the the signs are the vice versa if it was minus 9,919 so we were gonna add because now um, there is no difference in the sign or repulsion if I'm using the correct word so this would be minus 30 we will not consider the sign that we get there this would be 20,081 volts Thevenin voltage you can still use this one to calculate um, the Thevenin's voltage you will still get the same thing if you use this one not notice what is happening to that 7 volts um this 7 volts there which is 70 is positive on this side and negative notice what is happening to this one positive 13 volts negative so so you see what's happening so this means that here we are adding so this would be 7,083 plus 13 and this would be equal to 20,083 so you can see there is a small difference because we 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 choose the to round off before we we got to the final answer sorry now now that we know that the, the voltage here is 20 0, 0,8 let's just say volts we can calculate um the current across this resistor how by calculating the total resistance of the circuit this is a series circuit so r total would be 2,917 plus 2 and this would be equal to 4,917 now let's calculate um the, the the current the current will be calculated by uh, across this load resistor by the Thevenin's voltage which is twenty comma zero eight all divided by four comma nine one seven which is the total resistance of the circuit. Um, this will give us what that's the Thevenin's voltage now let's just divide there by four comma now twenty comma zero eight divided by four comma nine one seven this is equal to four comma zero eight four that's the current across that resistor so this is the only current that is relevant to this circuit these Thevenin's voltage resistance they not relevant to this circuit um, so this is the only thing relevant that was it on Thevenin's uh, theorem I hope you learned something comment like and subscribe i will i i that is highly appreciated